Hey what is going on guys welcome back to my channel and in today's video I'm going to be showing you basically the best team of the season players from this week that costs less than 100k so these are basically really overpowered players um, which I've used a few times in the draft and um, have just been really good and I, so I thought I'd show you guys um, obviously these aren't players that are like over 200k those players that are really expensive um, because obviously not a lot of people can afford them at the moment and um, they will go down in price but um, I'm just going to show you the ones now that cost less than 100k which have been pretty good so far. So um, as you can see here starting off in the goalkeeper position we have Oblak or Oblak I have no idea how you pronounce his name. Um, he, he's been a really solid goalkeeper for me I mean you could have Ariola, but this guy's a bit more expensive I think this guy costs only around 55k at the moment on PS4 um, so he's been really solid obviously he's going to he's going to stop shots with his head his body probably even his dick you name it this guy has, is going to be very solid in goal um, you're going to concede very few goals uh, moving on in centre midfield we have Bruno who is basically he is like basically a more expensive version of Ben Yat here um, Ben Yat's basically a slightly shitter version of Bruno um, as you can see Bruno's stats they're really well rounded so obviously this guy isn't the quickest with 64 pace but when you look at his other stats I think you could sort of make up for that He's got 84 dribbling, 85 defending, 86 physical, 88 passing and 82 shooting as you can see, very solid player. Um, yeah, like as I said, he's, he's basically just a better version of Ben Yat. If you can't afford, if you can't afford this guy, he's about 55k as I said, um, I'd, I'd go with this guy. He's still good, Ben Yat, um, but obviously he's, he's a good sort of like 20k cheaper at the moment. Um, if you waited a week, I'd say you could probably pick up Bruno for about 40k actually which would be very cheap for uh, his stats here stick this guy in centre defensive midfield and he's going to be an absolute rock um, in terms of Banya as well you know he's still a very good player um, but basically just a cheaper version of Bruno as I said moving on to Mascherano uh, the only centre back in these in these players here um, but you know he, he's very good obviously he's not the quickest 73 pace he's not your he's not your Sergio Ramos you know who's going to pace it um, in the middle of the park, but um, he's certainly going to dominate def your defence. Um, 90 defending, 86 physical. Uh, he's not the quickest of players. He's also got 82 passing as well, which is very useful to have on a centre back. But yeah, overall, really solid player. Definitely try and pick him up. I think he's around 90k at the moment, but uh, if you waited a few weeks, I reckon you could pick him up for about 60. Um, and then saving the best for last, I guess, these absolute beasts up the top here. We got Adjuris. I mean just look at his stats, I think they say it all to be honest, 95 shooting, 92 physical, um, obviously he's not the quickest player, uh, 80 pace, but I reckon that, that, that doesn't mean a thing I don't think, um, this guy is going to score shots from you, you name it, he'll probably score throw-ins even if you tried to shoot from them, um, this guy 95 shooting, he's just going to bang in goals like nobody's business, uh, 92 physical as well, He's got, I think he's got 99 heading in game. This guy is going to be very, very good at the top end of the pitch. Um, 88 dribbling as well. He's good on the ball. You name it, this guy is your, basically your perfect all-round striker. He's like your slightly smaller Ibrahimovic, basically. Um, and then moving on to Perez, as you can see here, this guy is a beast as well. Um, look at his stats. I mean, he's basically a slightly quicker but slightly weaker version of Adaris. Um, he's got awesome shooting, awesome passing. And he's also very quick as well. He'd be a great player to play up front with Adiris, just to sort of play off of him. But yeah, these great players here. So yeah, these are the players, guys, that cost under 100k. You should definitely try and pick them up if you can. Um, or just wait a few weeks until they're a bit cheaper, which they certainly will be after the La Liga team of the season. So I hope you enjoyed this video, guys. Remember to leave a like and subscribe if you're new around here. And I will see you in the next video.